Hey guys, so I'm going to do a quick haul of some things that I purchased recently and I'll give you some more views if I have um, used the products and have any thoughts on them. So the first thing is this Hard Candy Just Glow Baked Illuminating Powder and I have the Twinkle Star. Um, it comes in a package like this and then the, the duos on the front here. I really like this. I hear a lot of mixed reviews here on YouTube, but I really liked that product because I thought... Um, I thought the colors, like, it doesn't come off as, like, a Becca highlighter or something like that, but it has its own place, and if you're not a huge fan of, um, those really, really bright, like, BAM highlights, then you would like that. The next thing is, um, LA Colors Powder Blush in the color Bronze, so it's really a bronzer. It comes in a little, um, like, black container. And I haven't tried it yet, but I thought the color was so pretty that I had to scoop it up. And then this is a Balm Tastic Skin Naturally Committed Super Glam Lip Balm. And this doesn't really have a flavor, it just says yummy natural flavor. They don't test on animals. It's a woman-owned company, and they'll de donate 1% of all the net profits to protecting uh, the skins of all kind around the world. So it helps to save animals and their coats from like poachers and that kind of thing. And then I got this um, Deck the Eyes Dramatic Duo. This was, I think, out last year because I got it um, Black Friday. I got a set of this and it is the Pure Black Precision Eyeliner, which is um, a pen felt tip liner. And then the Big Look Mascara from uh, Pure Minerals. And this stuff was so good when I saw it on sale. It was originally 18 I got it for 5 I had to snatch that up, and I really like it. So the Big Look Mascara and the Precision Eyeliner, those are two really good products. And then I purchased this Bronze Booster from Physicians Formula in the shade Light to Medium. This was originally $14.29 on sale for $7.14 at Kmart, and I pick that up because a lot of people really like that and I had one before and I really liked it and then I picked up a couple more um, bronzers from Physicians Formula this is the Super BB Insta Ready Filter Trio BB powder in the Universal Filter uh, it comes in a box like this there's another one that comes in a similar box but that was the Super BB Filter uh, BB bronzer in the shade bronzer and that's the Insta Ready line too. So two Insta Ready lines. Those are really new, um, and I've been hearing good reviews. Also, a new bronzer from them is the Butter Bronzer with some Maru Maru Butter Bronzer. Um, this was in the shade Bronzer again. I just love this box. It's so cool. I can still smell the coconutty smell, um, but if you are um, sensitive to scents, this might not be the bronzer for you. Then I got this tonight. I was so excited to find this. This was the Photo Focus Lash Primer from Wet n Wild. I haven't seen anybody mention this here on YouTube, but I found this and was so excited. It is not a fiber mascara. This is just the like primer, the liquid primer uh, stuff, which I love. So I'm going to give that a shot and see how that is. And I recently purchased this Physicians Formula Color Correcting. Uh, it, it was a trio in here. So it came with the two, one's a highlighter and one's, um, one's a highlighter and one's a concealer. And then it has this correcting powder, which has the different colors in there. I've been using that and I really like it. And then it comes with this loose powder and I have not used that, but it's, it's uh, tinted and it's an SPF of 16. And I do look forward to using that. I think it should be really good. So lots of physician formula stuff. Then I just recently purchased from Sephora and Ulta. And these are going to be my last things for a while. Because now I'm like stocked up. So this is the Becca Afterglow palette. Um, you'll see all these in future videos. But this one has uh, five shades to it. I love the box. Ooh. Okay. It has five shades. It has Moonstone, Rose Gold, Topaz, and then it has two blushes um, in the shade Wild Honey and Flower Child. So that I've been using and loving. 
This is the Pure Minerals uh, Love Your Selfie Palette. It comes with eight shadows, a bronzer, blush, and illuminating powder, and a lip gloss, and the Big Look Mascara. So here's the Big Look Mascara. Um, this is the lip gloss and exposed. These are the colors over here. This is the Afterglow um, Illuminating Powder, which Ready Set Glamour always talks about, and then the bronzer and the blush. I really love these. Um, it's neutral with a couple purples shades in there, and this is a black, but I really love this palette, and I like that you could take this on the go because you have your bronzer brush, bronzer blush, highlight, all your shadows, a lip gloss, a mascara, so you really just need the other face um, products like foundation and powder, and you're good to go. And I recently purchased uh, the Air Perfection CC Cushion foundation with the SPF of 50 from Pure Minerals. This does come with uh, one refill also. And this was amazing. I used it today. It's what I have on my skin currently. Um, I've been wearing it for about 12 hours now. And it's not greasy. It's not oily. It looks natural on the skin. It gives me more than just a... Um, like a medium, it says medium coverage, but I think it looks more than that. It definitely covered any redness I have. It covered my dark circles. I applied it on the sponge. I, I dabbed it to the skin, and then I took a um, flat top brush and buffed it out. So really like that. And then I purchased, I'm trying to get all my Ulta things together. I purchased the Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons palette. I've been loving this. It's what I have in my eyes today. Uh, Cafe Latte is my favorite shade ever. Just putting that out there. But I've really been loving that. There are the shades on the back that you get. And who doesn't want this? The Becca box. Shimmering Pressed Perfector in Pearl. This is a newer shade that they just put out. And I love it. It's like stark white. And when you put it on, it's like, Oh my gosh, look at that highlight. I don't have it on today, but it's like, look at that highlight. Oh my gosh. And then I got the TARDIS contour palette. So excited for that because I love Tarte and I love contouring, um, but like in a natural way. And I think that with that palette, you can really do that. And then with um, the Tarte purchase, I also got one of their lip paints. I got the color Namaste. First of all, can we talk about that box? Because it's amazing. And then second of all, with the $30 um, purchase from Tarte, you got a uh, Clean Slate P Timeless Smoothing Primer uh, sample. And I have not tried that, but I look forward to it. And then I also got the Gwen Stefani palette because I have wanted that, so finally got it. Um, you know, a lot of neutrals. You have a pink, a bright pink, blue, a bright yellow, um, a couple blacks there, but a lot of neutral shades, and that's my style. Like some neutral with a couple pops of color. And then from Sephora, I purchased finally the ambient lighting palette from Hourglass. This is the one that has the three colors in it: the dim light, incandescent light, and radiant light. And that's what I have on my cheeks today, and I really love it because it gives me a natural glow, but it's not over the top. And then I purchased the Backlight Priming Filter from Becca. I'm looking really forward to trying this. I did try a little bit on my hand today, but um, I didn't want to use it and the new foundation at the same time. I wanted to wear one, then the other, just to see, um, you know, when you use too many new products, you can't tell which ones you like or don't like. So I wanted to try to feel them out on their own before I really start putting everything together. And then the last thing I got was the Narcissus palette from NARS. And this is L'Amour Toujours L'Amour eyeshadow palette. But I love that it's like Narcissist. And so... The palette itself is a mirror cover, and the thing about that, though, is I think it's awesome. One, because when it's just sitting there on my 
dresser, it says narcissist. And so when you walk in my room, the first thing you see is narcissist. And then the second thing is it's clever because you see narcissist, but you see your reflection in it. So it's like, oh, yeah, I'm a narcissist. But anyways, I love the palette. I think it's so cute. I will show you guys all those up close in future videos. I don't have them all close because I've been trying them all out. But um, like the ones I mentioned, I love and I look forward to trying the other ones soon and I will keep you updated and you will be the first to know of all my likes and dislikes. I love you guys. Follow me on Instagram, um, Snapchat for more up to date day to day things. I'll be trying a lot of these out and putting those up on there. So follow me on there and you will know everything and I look forward to talking to you soon.